I stumbled upon the coolest secret hike right in the middle of Hollywood. I can't wait to show you guys. Check it out. If you like outdoor adventures, definitely subscribe to this channel. And to any of you who hit the like button, I appreciate you so much. This secret hiking location has a name. It's called Trebek Open Space and is located in Nichols Canyon. I have walked right past this place over a hundred times on my way to Runyon Canyon and only recently noticed I could hike there because I saw trails on Google Maps. All right, I'm headed to Nichols Canyon. Gotta walk through this neighborhood. One piece of news is that I am recently single. So if it's always been your desire to have a chance with this, now's your chance. But it should mean I end up hiking more and making more videos. So that's good. I gotta get in shape. Get rid of that boyfriend fat. I didn't know if I could enter Trebek open space from the south side, from the Hollywood side. So I just went to the corner of Hollywood Boulevard and Curson Avenue. And I walked all the way to the end of Curson Avenue and saw this black gate, which luckily is unlocked. All right, I feel somewhat like a fugitive busting through that fence back there. So if I gotta run from the cops, I gotta run from the cops. One little problem with these roads is there's never a, there's never a sidewalk. So you're gonna have to uh, keep an eye out for these cars. They'd be coming around these corners real fast. So just dive. So you walk for about a quarter mile down this paved road until you reach a gate where the dirt path begins. The dirt path wraps around the ridge and leads you to this black gate, which makes it very clear that they do not want you going any further. And I even asked a local if this really was a dead end and she said, yes. So I thought that was all there was to this hike until I found another secret path and that's where the fun really begins. In order to access the hidden pathway, look for the telephone pole shortly after you pass the gate where the dirt path begins. You can walk up this trail and it will lead you to a whole nother set of trails. So what do you guys think about, um, let's say you're going to the gym and is it okay to work in with people like if it's busy? Like this guy was using actually a squat rack. He was deadlifting. And I was like, well, I can maybe use the squat rack. So I said, I, are you deadlifting here? And he said, yeah. I said, oh, do you mind if I, and before I could even finish my sentence, he said, yeah, I mind. Excuse me. <laughs> I just thought that was so rude. But then I thought, I don't know. Maybe he's really worried about COVID. I mean, he didn't have to interrupt me like that, but you know, I let it go. Okay, lucky for him, lucky for him, I let it go. <laughs> This is my friend Julio, and Julio has a very interesting story, which he said I can share with you. Julio is a lawyer from Venezuela and a month ago was granted political asylum by the United States. That basically means the United States is granting protection to Julio because if he is sent back to Venezuela, he will be sent to jail. And why? Because he spoke out and organized protests against the oppressive Venezuelan government. He escaped from Venezuela to Colombia, made his way to Mexico, and a month ago was granted political asylum from the United States. Talk about courage. So when I heard this story, I thought, oh, wow, poor Julio. He has no family here. He is not established yet. He's still learning the language. It must be so hard. But the truth is, Julio is grinning from ear to ear because he is so happy and appreciative to be in the United States. And it just reminded me to, number one, never forget 
how lucky we are to be in a free country. And two, you know, I saw Julio's situation as sad, but he saw the same situation as happy. So it just reminds me to look at the bright side of things. Here is why this secret hike is my favorite. Number one, it's super close to West Hollywood. It's closer than Runyon Canyon or any other hiking place. Number two, the views are incredible. You can see the Hollywood sign, Griffith Observatory, downtown LA, Century City, and the Pacific Ocean. And number three, it's super private. You almost have the whole place to yourself. So hopefully you get out there and try it. If you enjoyed this video, I'd appreciate a like and subscribe and I'll see you soon.